Good fat is monounsaturated fatty acids and polyunsaturated fatty acids. Research has shown that they're heart healthy, that there's different cholesterols in your body, and they're known to um, lower your LDL cholesterol, which is the bad cholesterol. There are absolutely fats that are bad for you um, that you really have to watch, and those are saturated fats and um, trans fats. Saturated fats are found in animal products. I really, really encourage my clients to watch the butter and the cheeses because those are really, really big sources of saturated fat. Trans fats are really, again, here is a man-made fat. It's found in a lot of processed foods. Margin is a big thing, although the industry is catching on and trying to use less trans fats. Good healthy fats for you are salmon, are a great source of omega-3s, and what's really interesting about that is that there are countries that are, eat more fish, like the Mediterranean, and they have a lower rate of depression and suicide. So omega-3s are really, really um, important for your brain, and they're also important for your heart. Olives also a great fat to incorporate into salads. Like I always say, just because they're healthy for you doesn't mean that they're limitless. It doesn't mean you can go crazy. With olives or olive oil, you still have to have the appropriate portion in your diet. Avocado also, that's a, that's a very healthy fat. That contains monounsaturated fatty acids as well. A lot of people can put this whole avocado into their salad and that would be a lot of fat and a lot of calories. Just be cautious of that. Just because it's good doesn't mean it's limitless. You need fats in your diet. There should not be a, such a thing as a fat-free diet. If you're eating foods like salmon and like the chia seeds and like nuts, and avocados, you are getting a sufficient amount of healthy fats in your diet.